gas was really rare. You know, so we had 100 acres of land. Well, we had gas and just enough to work your land. But then when it came in the fall of the year, if you wanted to work your land more, the government would give you gas. But you wouldn't dare, dare sell the gas to, to some of your neighbors or give it away because that would have been black market. You would have got condemned for that. They were really, really important. So he put me on the tractor. He had a farm in fields there. It was half a mile long, two forties long. He put me on there in that F-20. He did the same thing. He made a nice box for me to sit. I couldn't sit on, on I couldn't stand up on it because I couldn't see over the steering wheel. And then he would put me on there and I would work, work the fields. And every noon I'd see him come across the field. He'd come with his five gallon can of gas. Shut the tractor off pour the gas back in it, in the tractor. Then he, he started back up, but you had to crank it. You didn't have starters, and they cranked the tractor. You couldn't use much for your cars. You could use it to go to church, maybe, and maybe to the store, but you, you couldn't <coughs> dare go to dances and stuff like that. You know, gas was really, really racial. <coughs> 